Greetings, nerds. Have something I need to talk to you about. Gotta get it off my chest. What if Miles Morales is Thor? People are calling this racist. I'm going to take a look at that, but I just got to say this writing is a hot mess. This is terrible. This is bad. Stereotypical. Absolutely. Racist? Maybe. I mean, I don't like to just throw that term around because really, those, I mean, that's fighting words. You, when you throw up that word, throw out that word, it's, it's throwing fists up. You are going to cause a fight. And I only want to mention that because as it's important to talk about racism in today, we need to find a space where we can talk about this honestly, about these issues. Because if we don't, we're never going to progress further. This comes from this white Christian male 40s dude. All right. Nobody wants to hear from me. I'm the most unattractive demographic in that area. But I just want to say that it's important. It's important for for me, for everyone to be able to have a voice. This story, though, I wish they would have shut up. It is very bad. Uh, there's some stuff talking about, you know, Asgard is my hood. Uh, the thing that I kind of was like, what? Is Sif comes flying in. Hot wings coming in hot. No joke. No joke. Hot wings coming in hot. And then it drops every single one-liner from a hip-hop hammer time. That one's, I think, mildly musing. But the rest, uh, there was one pobrecito in there. Um, pobrecito King's work is never done. Just because Miles is half Puerto Rican, half African American, if I'm if I'm correct. But everywhere there's this one-liner, it's it's bad. It's just not good all eyes on me jumping up on the table come on quoting tupac i mean it's just it's just in poor taste it's cheesy i mean some of the art's pretty cool the art was the only redeeming factor of this comic as a comic but this was just stereotypical and it just wasn't that good of a story uh, i think marvel was trying to do a cash grab with Miles Morales popularity and what if popularity and just because that's what it is. Every issue was a different Miles as Wolverine, Miles as Hulk, um, Captain America. That was the only one I didn't read. This also started off this comic book as like a rap. I kind of write it as a poem because that's what I know as a lit major from college. White guy. Hey, guilty as charged. I digress. This was not literature. This is crap. And don't judge Miles Morales on this comic. No. This is bad. This Miles Morales. This is what you should be reading. This the main storyline from Marvel from Miles Morales. Miles Morales is the good one. It's more kind of multiverse stuff, but it is well written. Is not offensive. It's a good superhero story. It's a good human story about being people, about being a real human. And that's and that's what Spider-Man stands out for being. What whatever he is, Ben Riley, Peter Parker, Miles Morales, Miguel O'Hara, it's about being human. That's what makes a great Spider-Man story. The underling, underdog taking over, kicking butt. Um, you know, whether it's a nerdy white kid or, you know. Puerto Rican, African American, Miles, they're all awesome. Um, they, and all those stories need to be told. So, well, do, do, do they all need to be told? I guess maybe let's take a step back here. Marvel, this blew up in your face. Sorry, kind of deserved it. This author also, by the way, writes very kid kitty kind of stuff. I just looked at some of the covers and it looked very much Captain Underpants, 
So this author is used to talking to that very cheesy Saturday morning cartoon. And that's what that felt like. Again, not all miles are equal. Walk in this mile of shoes. That's it. I've said enough. Thank you. Let me know what you think. Post in the comments. Sorry for being an angry white guy. Can we all just get along?